Oh, what are we seeing, Kate? She's a strong attack in the middle. Thought it was going to happen, but it did. It's interesting, early, so earlier in the day, we saw a lot of attacks from play off the line from Bavani. Yeah, she's holding it back a little bit, I think. And you fence yeah. both of these two, haven't you? And when you're, yeah. when you're fencing at this level, when you're fencing um, athletes like this, what is it that you're looking for? You don't want to rush in the middle. That's the first thing I would say. Um, finishing your preparation. Being decisive with your actions, um, any time you go in the middle, especially in Sabre, if you're not 100% with your actions, you're going to get hit. Um, decisive. Oh, it's beautiful nice. from Bavani. Setting that one up is beautiful. Five touches so far. Who, anyone got the edge? What are you seeing? Mm. It's, it's, quite, uh, it's quite easily matched, e equally matched at the moment. Oh. You talked at the start. There we go. Right there was, she oh, fell short. Beautiful. I was not seeing that. It was good. Right at the start, you said no one's really put Bavani's yeah. attack under pressure. And it's the first time she's made a miss twice now. Yeah, attack for Bavani. I think she's ever so slightly stronger than Vincilia, but we'll see. Oh. Sebastieva's called for video. I think she believes that that first one from Bavani is no. Psychologically, if that's correct. Does that give uh, Vasilyeva a bit of an edge? Referee Duvis is stuck with it. So 4-3, yeah. Devani lead. Bavani leads. Preparation again. Yeah. Lovely. So what are we seeing from Vasilyeva? What's she trying to do? What's the, think, the young athlete trying to do? I think she's do? trying to push Bavani through the middle, but Bavani is really strong. She's getting in preparation. Yep, attack. Yeah, nice attack. So she's getting her. I can see Bavani faking, fainting that and trying to make her miss. Well, oh, we've gone to video again. We've gone to video. I think it's like Bavani's called video. The so when we when we were talking in the semi-finals and as we gone through, referee Duva stays with it. We were saying Vasilyeva. It feels like she comes in uh, deeper, more aggressive into the middle of the piece, whereas Bavani uh, Bavani looks like she sits uh, a bit shallower. Um, sits a bit shallow, it doesn't commit as far into the middle. Why might fences change up the distance or the timing that they go into the middle? I think she knows that Vasileva is going to have that nice strong attack, so she's just waiting for it to go, making a fall short, picking up the attack. And yeah, so yep. Vasileva didn't pick up the attack quick enough after making a fall short, and Bavani straight onto that uh, with the renewal of the attack. And Bhavani is you know, the most experienced fencer in the draw here. You know, the first uh, Indian fencer to qualify for um, the Olympic Games. That sort of touch, that's the sort of touch that a senior fencer knows to go for. Yeah, she's and confident in that action. Big attack off the line from Vasilyeva, but, Vasilyeva, but is this uh, maybe a, a hint of impatience off with that attack? Yeah, I think it shows that not so much immaturity, but I think Bavani's in that right mental stage. You can take that risk and not have to, you know, you don't have to go for that attack. You can wait, let them, you know, do what they're doing, whether it's a mistake or not, faint it and then make it miss. And I think Bavani's really confident in her middle that she's able to do that. She's able to switch quite quickly from doing one action to the next. She's not like getting stuck doing the same thing as well. One of the things I felt earlier watching was the way that um, Bavani sets herself up in the middle. Yeah, she doesn't, she doesn't commit very deep in. No, no, and no. it feels like she doesn't give away many free points. She's got such a small preparation and going and picking up the attack or a small preparation, looking and then drawing something. So if you're Vasilyeva now, you're 4-8 down, you're fencing someone who they, you shoot back in if you're Vasilyeva. Well, I know that the, um, Bavani's going to try and make me miss. So you're going to have to attack through that middle or give Bavani something. Yeah, yeah, of you course. know what, a second. It's going to have to be everything. It can't, nothing here is going to be direct. I don't think a direct attack is going to be successful uh, unless it's Bavani's because they're just amazing. But um, no, you're going to have to give Bavani something, make it miss. I mean, of course, you're talking about a fencer like Bavani. You, you're going to have to expect to attack the entire length of the piece, aren't you? She's going to work yeah. all 14 meters. And it won't just be one tempo either. It'll be a, she'll break it up and push her right to the end. So there's what we're talking that about. That was a good idea. It was a good idea for Vasileva. She didn't com fully commit under that last hit on the attack. But that's right. She didn't go. She didn't commit too early in the middle. Uh, I think she could have taken that. 
she had the attack and I think, I think she feels like maybe the risk that she's playing you know she comes in so hard so aggressive to force stuff the risk is maybe she gets stranded in the middle yeah you make that action if you've made the action before the other fence has actually done anything that sort of that the anxiety of it you like and I have to make them fall short and they've not actually done anything to need it all day it's oh maybe the first unforced error I've seen from Bhavani Devi all day yeah. Nice. Beating it, the attack, power post. Beautiful textbook. It's Love exactly it. what you said, Vasilyeva, you know, aggressive, fast, but it's direct. Nice. Ooh. So where are we at in this match? What's, what's catching your eye? Not really come out of the middle that much. Ooh, bit of a slip up from Bavani there. You've got to say about Vasileva, she is consistently at such a high intensity off the line. Yeah, she's dealing with this, the pressure of it really well. Ooh. What do we say? Tack. Tack touche. And Vasileva has used both of her videos, so there's no opportunity to go and get that looked at. Yeah, see, direct attack in the middle. It's just, you know that she's going to make you fall short. You know she's setting you up for something. It's... Yeah. And that's the problem, isn't it? So you think, okay, I'll wait a bit longer in the middle and then bang, she'll hit you on preparation. Oh, it's a great attack. Nice. What, what makes that attack so good, Kate? It just goes straight through. Like, you hit, you state it, right? She got stuck on that line and it's such a long lunge as well. Attack. Referee Andreas Duvis has given that as an attack for Vasilyeva. Bavani Devi has con gone for the video on it. We're just watching a replay of that big Bavani attack for, to go to the 14th point. It's, it's like you said, it's the length of it, isn't it? You know, if you're not going past what, if you're not going three meters behind your on guard line, that's hitting you. Yeah. Duvis stays with his decision, 8-14. Ooh, must be attack by Vasilyeva. Yeah. It absolutely it is. It was a good decision. Before, she didn't get that one because she wasn't picking up the timing. That one, she made a good adjustment. Ooh. So Bhavani finds the timing. It's into the guard. 10-14. Are we about to see something special? Nice. <laughs> no, it wasn't going to Shut the door. <laughs> the 2018 Commonwealth champion becomes the 2022 Commonwealth champion. Bhavani Devi of India is the Commonwealth champion. Veronica Vasilyeva, the silver medalist.